watching you on stage, it was so wonderful seeing you in the zone. Oh, okay. It was very beautiful. I enjoyed it. Do you always like? Do you always have moments like that, or do you have times where I it's hard? I certainly hope so. I mean, it's yeah? just kind of an expression. I think it's my letting off steam time. Whether it's a happy steam or a bad steam, mm. that's, that's the time I get to do it. Does music have a certain role in your life for you? Does it play a certain role? In your uh, life? Yeah, it's pretty major. Is it ranks right up there in the top three things what as is, far do you as? Ever, yeah. I mean, it, it translates uh, my life. Really, it's just a translation of my life, whatever that is. Whether it's happy, sad, joyful, exciting, you know, um, or angry. Mm. Yeah, that's that's what that's for. I think that's why that was given to me. <laughs> Gosh, how did you start doing music? What what made you want to start? Um, well, it was always there. Uh, my father's a saxophone player. His father's a trumpet player. His wow. father is a keyboardist. <laughs> so, and uh, see, the grandfather had 14 children. They were all musical. Uh, no one did it for a living. It's not for everybody. Mm -hmm. But uh, it was just kind of there. And I guess because uh, I picked up something that had a novelty to it, it kind of caught on. And so it's been like over 30 years to this now. That is so amazing. Yeah, thank you. Was there a, was there a point in your life, maybe when you're a little kid or when you just start before that point you started playing music, where you were like, "This is it. This is what I want to do." What, I started in junior that? high school, and I think uh -huh. by the time I was a junior in high school, I knew this was what I wanted to do. I was it was scary because I grew really up, yeah, why town, why was it scary for you? I grew up in a town uh, in Portsmouth, Virginia, in a town where people just didn't do music for a living. So mm. they you either got married, joined the military, or you joined you worked in a shipyard or something like that. And I wanted to play music, and people were like, "Well, you can't make a living doing this," and it was scary. So I didn't major in it. I didn't mm -hmm. go to school for it or anything like that. Mm -hmm. I just kind of played. I played in the Virginia Symphony for a while and did my jazz gigs on the side. Oh. And, uh, and then after that, I, I came out here and uh, I got married and then divorced. And when I was by myself, mm -hmm. that's when I actually went for it. Oh, my <laughs> yeah. gosh. So this must be a very empowering moment for you then. Yeah. Being I've able to, to do what you want to do regardless yes. of what other people think. Yes. And that's very yes. hard for people. Yeah, it is. It's, it's a scary thing to do. But I, I'd yeah. rather do this and be happy than to be rich and be unhappy. And yeah. unhappy yeah. in life. Yeah. yeah. Totally. Thank you so much. Right, thank you. Okay, we're here at the Pasadena Jazz Festival. I'm Ashley from Music Beat.